It's time for another edition of our Ask the Trooper segment where we are joined by Trooper Ryan Davis with Louisiana State Police and he talks to us about some safety things, you know, some different topics and today you might have been seeing that little light in your car that yeah. has the tire pressure yeah. thing. So today we're going to talk about that because it is getting cold outside so that's kind of a common thing to see. So thanks for joining us as we talk about this yes, today. Alright, so what are some things we need to know about our tire pressure and also what should we look out for? Okay, so on average you're, you're Tire pressure can decrease one PSI for every 10 degree drop in temperature. So, you know, this time of year, we could go from a 30, 30th degree morning to a 70 degree mm -hmm. evening. So you, your tire pressure could lower four, four PSI or more. So what that means driving down the road with the decreased tire pressure, you run the risk of not only damaging your tires, but it decreases the effectiveness for as far as gripping for evasive maneuvers. Mm -hmm. Um, braking so yeah. those are you know we don't want to we want to be in the best position to stay safe so yeah. keeping your tire pressure at the correct level is very important definitely and so what are some practical things that we can do now even if it's not like super cold outside now just to right. kind of prepare for that as it comes right you we'll make sure your tires are at the appropriate PSI um, it's listed on the tire as well as in your, your manual and your glove box for your vehicle. A lot of people think you need to over inflate them. That's not correct okay. because during the day as the temperature fluctuates, it'll, it'll lower, but it'll also increase as the tire increases, okay. tire uh, temperature increases. So you want to make sure you're at the upper limits of the recommendation because if it's three to four PSI low, when it starts at the correct PSI, you'll you'll still be good at those lower temperatures. Okay, that's interesting. Busting some myths, because I have always heard that you have to over inflate it, like when it's cold and everything. So you run the risk of having too much air pressure yeah. once the tire uh, temperature increases or the ambient temperature in the in the atmosphere. Yeah. Wow, uh, that's interesting. Yeah, definitely important. I, I feel mm -hmm. like I always see my, my light go on and off, like when mm -hmm. the temperature's dropping and raising, dropping. So definitely important to know um, about that as we run into some lower temperatures. Oh, yeah. yeah, coming up and maybe hopefully some snow. So we should know hopefully that. Hopefully we have We've a light snow. You, you, really need, you need good tire treads for snow. Yeah, right. <laughs> definitely. Maybe if we get some snow, we'll, we'll come to that and we'll focus on that. But for right now, we're you know, not looking at that. But thanks so much for joining us this morning and definitely remember that as you stay safe on the roads. The sticker, I will be right back after the break.